Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. Um, as you can see, I've done my base. And so sorry about the hair, but it's kind of dirty. Um, today I really want to do a green look. And I really want to use the Misha Lu Witchcraft palette. I used this yesterday off cam, but I did a purple look with it. Um, it looks like this. And I really want to do a green look just because... This is a, a really cool green, uh, like duochrome. So I want that as my inner corner highlight. And then I want to do like a green, I want to use Potion and Cauldron, which is those two. And then I want to take that dark green on my lid. So if you want to see like a green smoky eye, um, then just please keep on watching. I'm going to film my lip my lip collection, my lipstick and liquid lipstick collection after this, so um, yeah, anyway uh, I'm taking the shade Potion which was the lighter of the greener ones and I'm going to use this as a transition shade so I'm just going to take a fluffy brush since I've done my base I have concealer on my lid but I have uh, um, powdered it so it's not sticky So I'm just taking some of this and kind of dragging it in my crease and trying to blend it a little bit. Maybe I'm I'm going to go in with my Morphe M433 instead um, just to get the more denser brush and kind of pack the pigment on this is not a unique green shade at all but I really wanted to use it I'm going to leave it like that for now and I'm just going to do the other eye there we go something like that I'm just going to pay my parking I just remembered it's Saturday here, so I have to pay uh, parking for my car. There we go. Uh, I'm taking that fluffy brush we, I used in the beginning. And I'm just go going to try to blend this out a bit. Um, this eye looks a little bit more browny than this one. I think I had some pigment left on this brush actually. So sorry about that. Not sure from what though. Okay, I'm just cleaning the M433 brush on my um, Veramona color switch and I'm going to take Cauldron which is just a, a little bit darker if you can see or it not maybe not darker but another shade of green and I'm going to place that on my outer corners and in my crease And I got some fallout from that. That I will remove in just a second. So I'm just going to do the same to the other eye. Something like this. Um, going back into the potion shade with my fluffy brush. I'm just going to take some of that. Like this. And then I'm just going to use that to blend this out a bit like this I took it quite far up um, but that happens uh, I'm going to take the shade called um, 
crescent which is a dark shimmery green and I'm going to place that kind of all over my lid uh, and in the beginning I will not spray this I just need to um, I just want that darker green on the lid as for now This had a little bit of fallout as well. Maybe I should spray this. I'm getting out my Fix Plus. Did you see the difference there? A lot more payoff. When it comes to color, something like that. I'm just going to do the same to the other eye, something like this. I'm going in. Um, to this little round brush and I'm just going to take this shade called Black Witch it looks kind of black but it's more of a like a no it swatches black okay sorry I was going to say it, lean, it was leaning on a really dark green because it looks like that in the pan but also the wand shade here looks pretty brown but when you add it on when you have it in a purple look it kind of leans towards purple so maybe this is like the same so I'm just going to take some of that and kind of deepen up the outer corner just a little bit and I have to say I do really love this palette I think it's really versatile when it comes to how many different looks you can do even though there are mostly greens and purples you can do quite I, th I believe you can do quite a natural look with this I mean you don't have to do a green smoky eye I'm changing up the brush I need something more like this And then I'm going back into the Morphe, um, Morphe brush and I have some pigment left on this from the lighter shade but that's okay I'm just going to blend in that black a bit. Something like this. Um, then I'm actually going to take this brush and I'm going to um, start off with no I'm going to take a I'm going to take this little brush from elf it's a really old brush and I'm just going to pack on some color on my waterline or my uh, under my eyes and I'm going to take that crescent shade which was the darker greener uh, shimmer shade and kind of just Press this on. Something like that. I'm just going to remove some fallout. Um, then with that uh, rounded fluffy brush I'm going to take Potion which was the lightest green and I'm just going to um, blend this out a bit with the, the lighter shade.
There we go, it's time some, for some inner corner highlights. Um, and I'm going to take that White Witch one. I don't know if you can see, but it's a really gorgeous, kind of like a green... Um, uh, there you have that. It's gorgeous. And I'm not going to spray this at first, I'm just going to place it here. Maybe I should spray it. I'm just going to do the same to this eye first. There we go. I just need to add some mascara um, and I might want to take like a shade like a white shade on on my brow bone just to kind of even out the green and I'm going to pick a lip color and I'm thinking about picking red but you will see that I'll be right back this is the finished look. I'm on my lips. I'm wearing the Tarte Tarte's lip paint in XOXO, uh, which is kind of like a candy apple red, or maybe this is a bit darker. Uh, on my lashes, I'm just wearing the same mascara I've been wearing for the last weeks. Uh, it's the Essence Lash Princess Volume Mascara. And I do believe that this gives me quite a good volume to my lashes. Um, please don't mind my uneven lips. I suck at applying lipstick and uh, liquid lipsticks. You know that. But anyway, this is the finished look. And I have to say that I really love this. Um... As I mentioned, oh, these glasses were dirty. Uh, as I mentioned, the the Witchcraft palette is kind of one of my favorite palettes now. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, so if you don't own that, I think you should. Uh, I think they are releasing a new palette soon. I, I saw a tease on Instagram, I think. Or maybe it's, it's already out. I'm not sure. Anyway, it's the Misha Lou brand. And the packaging and everything looks totally amazing. I have kept the sleeve because I'm a nerd. Um, yeah. I love this. Um, so give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And please subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And until I make another video, you guys, please take care. Bye.